Ladies and gentlemen, it is possible that one day we will have two worlds. The real one, which we all live in, and also the virtual world. A perfect reflection of everything we do, but in a digital format. Advances in technology are in fact making this an increasingly possible scenario. In the early 1990s, a professor of computer science at Yale University wrote a book called Mirror Worlds, in which he spoke of a future in which people look into their computer screens and see reality. He imagined people looking at a bright computer image showing the minute details of schools, hospitals and homes. This prediction is in fact becoming reality thanks to an increase in sensors in our lives as well as cameras and wireless networks. Google Earth and Google Street View allow anyone with an internet connection to visit anywhere on Earth. And to add to this, even farm cows are equipped with sensors that track their every move. Electricity companies now use smart power meters in order to measure electricity consumption. Smartphones nowadays are full of sensors and at least one camera. There are apps or applications which make use of this information in order to determine a wide range of things from the user's location to the light levels of the room the user is in even. A new and recent development has gone even further in merging the real world with a virtual world. This is augmented reality. Users can hold their smartphone up to a building or street so that the camera can recognize it. The app will then provide the user with information about which businesses work inside a building or whether is a house is up for sale. This is all very exciting, but we must be careful since having two worlds which are perfectly merged together can mean that an incredible amount of information is available to whoever knows how to access it. Security questions arise. What if a hacker can gain access to every detail regarding all our lives? What if a malevolent government decides to use the information in a virtual world in the wrong way? Could we end up with a Big Brother government? Will Google rule our lives in coming years? Thank you.